Hello and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today we will talk about uh, my favorite garden spray, which is the garden spray that has sorted most of my garden issues without having to use commercial bot or chemical based insecticides or pesticides. So neem oil is one of the most powerful ingredients you will find as a gardener to use on your garden as a garden spray. So this one will help you fight mealybugs, it will help you fight um, it will help you fight white flies, it will also help you fight funguses and bacteria. So let's get into this video and make some neem oil for my plants. So you will need neem oil and what you're looking for is cold pressed neem oil that has not been processed because there's an ingredient in neem oil called azeductin which is what you really need for your plants. If you find the one that doesn't contain that one, if it's processed, if it's not cold pressed, that will not help you. You're going to spray your crops and it's not going to work. So find neem oil that is crude, that is not processed, that is cold pressed and contains a chemical called azeductin. Azeductin is actually usually in the neem oil itself. So if it's not purified, you're sure that that's a good neem oil. So what you need is neem oil itself, cold pressed neem oil. So I really can't tell you where to buy this one because I got gifted and this one recently by my friend. So you need one tablespoon of this. So the reason why I use gloves when I'm, I'm working with neem oil is because neem oil has a smell that I don't like and it lingers in the hands for long. So I just don't like to, to have it on my hands. I don't like to touch it with my bare hands. And then you'll need two spoons of soap, dish soap. So always as a rule, as a golden rule, whenever you're using a DIY, pesticide, insecticide, always remember to test spray because what, worked for, what works for some people may not work for you. So I'm, I'm using this spray bottle which is graduated so I can see, I can see the water level also. So you need one liter of water and that's about one liter. Cover it tightly and shake. You have to shake it really well for the oil to disperse in the water. And then you pump. Yeah. So we will spray my my orange tree. You can see my orange tree is getting infested, so We'll fully cover it completely, even the stem. Okay, my pole beans also have been infested by white flies. If you, if you do this, you can see them flying away. So just spray. Beans do really well in my garden. They are not, they don't require a lot of care, but this time I can see some white flies. Probably because this place had tomatoes, and tomatoes are very vulnerable to pests. So I'm, I'm doing crop rotation. When I harvested my tomatoes, I put beans, because beans are nitrogen fixers and tomatoes are heavy nitrogen con consumers. So probably this space was uh, depleted of nitrogen. So that's it for this video. Thank you so much for coming and watching this video. Always remember, if you have a vision, add some passion. Goodbye.